A gun threat led to an unexpected day off for some middle school students in Dixie County. TV 20's Jordan Markov explains why, despite the arrest, some parents were still nervous about sending their children to school. It all started when a student at Ruth Raines Middle School posted a photo on Snapchat of him holding a gun. What's going on with these kids nowadays? It may look like any other day at the Cross City Middle School, but it's not common for parents to be pulling into the car loop this early. He had called and said uh, that he needed to be picked up. They had a, a want to have a shooting at the school, so we were very concerned about it. That's because a 13 year old boy posted this picture on Snapchat with the caption, don't come to school Monday. Dixie County Sheriff's officials say the weapon is a pellet pistol. Saturday night I was notified there was a, a social media post of a student. I immediately contacted law enforcement. At that time they began a active investigation. That's when Dixie County Sheriff's deputies arrested the student and charged him with a second degree felony of terroristic threats. It's scary because you, you don't know if they're going to really do it or not, even if it's a joke or not. Morella's son wasn't the only student who didn't go to school because of this threat. You know, I have four children on my own, so it's uh, it's important that uh, parents know that we are doing everything possible to keep those uh, students safe. He says sheriff's deputies have not expressed concern over any other students being a threat at this time. Reporting in Cross City, Jordan Markoff, TV 20 News.